Okra don't always burn in vain. Today I will teach you a new approach that is different, guaranteed that you have never eaten like this. It tastes better than boiled ones. Also more nutritious. We bought the okra. Clean it with salt water first. Next, pour a little more water into the pot. Add a spoonful of salt. Add a little cooking oil. Then pour the washed okra down and blanch it. Added salt and cooking oil. It keeps the okra green. Control the water after blanching. Take it out. Put it in a cool oven prepared in advance to cool. After it's cold, fish it out and put it on the cutting Cut board. off the head of the okra first. And then you slice the okra. Okra is shaped like a pepper. That's why some of us here call it chili. It cuts out beautifully. Like, like a five-pointed star. Looks appetizing too. The white burnt okra can be eaten directly after blanching Cut it, it in out water and put it in a large bowl. Next, prepare an onion. First, cut the onion into thin shreds. Then, change the knife and cut into minced onions. After cutting, put it in a bowl for later use. Prepare two red peppers. Cut into horseshoes with a slanting knife. Prepare two more green pepper. Slice it up too. After cutting, put it in a bowl for later use. Prepare a small section of cut green onions first, and we cut them into little filaments. Finally, cut into scallions. After cutting, put it in a bowl for later use. Prepare a few more cloves Make of garlic. Make it flat with a knife. Then cut into minced garlic. After cutting, put it together with scallions. Put a few cereals and eggs in the bowl. Add a little salt to the base, a few more drops of white vinegar. Then stir well with chopsticks. Break the eggs. When we were beating eggs, pick it up with chopsticks like this. The eggs that are beaten it like will this be are more fluffy and soft. Stir well and set aside for later use. Then we pour the onions into a large bowl. All the cut okra is also poured in. Add a little salt to the base. Then pour in the scrambled eggs. Then stir well with chopsticks. Let these three ingredients be combined together. Add an appropriate amount of cooking oil to the pot. After the oil is hot, pour the okra egg liquid into the pan. Spread them out with a shovel first. Don't rush to flip. Fry the bottom until set. After the bottom is finalized, spin the pan again. Let it heat evenly. Fry it until fragrant. Fry until golden on the bottom. Flip it over and fry the other side. Fry it on both sides until golden brown. It will taste better. Dear friends, you can see the video here. If you think my video, if it helps you, please extend your rich hand and give me a like. Your every message and forwarding is what keeps me going. Thank you for your support. Just fry it like in the video. Then pour it out and put it on the cutting board. 
cut it into small pieces with a fruit knife. Swipe it vertically first. And then a few slashes across. It can be cut into square cubes. You can also cut them into diamonds. After all are cut, put it on a plate for later use. In fact, you can also eat it directly at it's this fried time. fried eggs with okra. Next, add a little more oil to the pan. Then pour the chopped scallions and garlic down and fry until fragrant. After frying the incense, add the chili pepper and continue fry to the fry the peppers incense. until they die. Add a little salt after frying incense, a little sugar to freshen up, a spoonful of light soy sauce. Continue to stir fry evenly. Let all the seasonings in it melt. Then pour the okra egg patty down and fry until fragrant. Fry him more. Let all the eggs absorb ginger and garlic. Flavor fragrance. Such a delicious gumbo omelette. It's ready to go. Then we can load it into the disc. Enjoy it beautifully. Buy okra home in the future. Don't just know buy jewel or fry it and eat it. Try this method. Fragrant and smooth. Spicy and tasty. It's good to drink and eat. If you feel good too, just collect it and try it. Well, today's video is shared here. If you like my video, remember to Leave like a it message and, and forward it. it. See you in the next video. Thank you for your support.